to hand very shortly. Scott dominating the ruck because he's playing in front, but it's Wood for Richmond who gets it, smothered by Lee Matthews. And the players are inching that ball around the member's side of the stand. It's just between the wing and the half-forward line. As Bob Hurd got his hand to it, that was uh, Tuck getting the kick away. Martello's had a fit of the fumbles at the moment, running through home, crashing his way through, screwing it back over. Hudson in front position. He's got it. Seven minutes gone at the MCG. Hawthorne, one, two. Richmond yet to score. The throw in, Scott in ruck, up against Hurd. The ball comes to ground. Scott elbows Hurd out of the way. Play on, said the umpire. The ball under a pack, and umpire Harvey Lyons comes in and will ball it up. Forward set a half forward. A big leap down there by Matthews. No mark. Reigns for Richmond, gets a handball out under pressure. Royce Hart can't bend down and pick it up. Very scrappy football, finally picked up by Petura, but Kevin Sheedy gets the free kick for Richmond. And there's a blue behind play. Royce Hart, six kicks for Richmond in the first quarter. Bartlett for Richmond. Long kick just offline. And a great mark has been taken down there by Neil Barn. Over the last couple of years. Knocked away by Malthouse, who's playing a great game. Certainly Richmond are getting the benefit of his best football since he came across for St Kilda. That was Carter. Beautiful pass right down the throat of Petura. Petura doing well. I think he enjoys his position playing in the centre, covering a lot of ground as he rakes that kick down towards Brian Wood. Beautiful placement. Wood with an open goal, let's go, drop it right through for a point. To Hawthorne, one bounce and a drop kick, out of half back up towards the centre of the ground, Goad was there, Bartlett in front of him, Bartlett held when not in possession and gets the free kick. Bartlett from the centre circle, inside of half forward, there again with Walter, a big leap at the back by O'Halloran. and it's picked up now by Lamb, one bounce into the goal square and Lamb kicks truly. Left centre wing, punched in field, chance for uh, Martello. Martello's kick up towards half forward. Jenkinson punches away from Hudson. Goad near the centre circle, ridden into the ground. Play on, said the umpire. It's picked up by Richmond's reins. He finds Carter unmarked at half forward. Carter can score from here. He lines up the goals and shoots. Great goal by Richmond. Oh, Halloran got it away. This is range for Richmond. Richmond have it on a string, up the full forward, knocked away, picked up quickly by Scrimshaw into an open goal! Deep in front by Hendry, no mark taken, handball out by Richmond, finally it's Matthews, great chance to score, Lee Matthews, his third goal. Quarter because the first quarter lead was good, hurt the battle, they combine once more, tremendous combination these two, Kelvin Matthews sort of swipes it away, Robert Lamb picks up, Gets it on the side of his boot and drops it through. Playing on the wing. Wings it straight down towards Alan Edwards. Oh, clever mark. By gee, that was a good mark. Grass high. And Manane for Hawthorne. Goad spills the mark. It was Manane. Up towards half forward. McGee. Oh, through him to Hendry. Hendry, a much improved player in the third quarter. McGee in pursuit, Hendry kicks for goals and has scored a goal. A great kick by... Go and tuck, but it's all Richmond as Petura spins in and spins out. McGee on all fours. Monteith with a very poor attempt to tackle in. Goad gets it away for Hawthorne. Abbott onto his boot. Up towards Lee Matthews, a bit short for the opposition, but he's got it. Great mark. There's a lay down Mazer there, one out the game for the ball. Double hands it towards uh, Matthews. Martello playing a great game in the second half. Drives the ball straight up the full forward. The flying mark attempted by Hendry. Hudson's kicked uh, three goals, gets it, swings around, unselfish it, go, opens up, straight through. Third and Scott in ruck. Scott to the back of the pack, goes to Lamb, kicks into a player. Heard a handball to Bartlett. Bartlett shoots the goal from Richmond and puts it through. Five and a half minute mark, final quarter. Baum and Scott. Baum taps down to Bartlett. Bartlett's going to get another kick here, up towards half forward, Wood unmarked. Steady's down for Richmond. Gets around Moncrief, can shoot for goal now. Wood, a great looking kick. It's a goal! He didn't line up on the forward line at all, and has played pretty well, particularly the first half. 
a quiet second quarter, but he's back in business in this last quarter. Trying to find Edwards, great mark. Scott in front position, taps down towards Ede, who punches further afield to Lee Matthews, chance for Hawthorne, Matthews finds a player unmarked, the mark is taken, and handball to Hudson, and Hudson puts it through. Hudson's fifth goal, and a clever handball by Rice, who's come onto the ground in the last minute of play. Peter Hudson's fifth, and Hawthorne have a break. They lead by nine points. Hawthorne lead by four points. Jess, well, now it's Edwards. Edwards cornered. He gets caught, handballs away. Royce Hart. A big leap in the back by Jess. trail by four points and Jess has this kick for goal from right in front from 20 metres out. What a sensation he's been since he came on the ground. Kick two goals. A straight kick will put Richmond in front. Jim Jess. It's a point. No, it's a goal. The goal umpire signal point at first and then gave it two flags and Richmond are in front. Desperation. Hawthorne one kick they can win it. Knocked away there by Baum. Knocked through for point. <laughs> Richmond have won it by one point. One point the Tigers have come home. What a fantastic match. The scoreboard. Richmond 19-6, that's 120, Hawthorne 17-17, 119, a classic at the MCG.